at a glance. I noticed Talentum and Prima Donna on the first floor. Uh, Protocol and Cafe Sweetie have gone up to the second floor. Might be a good idea to go to one of the floors and chat with them. Oh shit. Damn. Oh no. This is one of those hard choices. Uh. Let's go to the second floor. The second floor? This is your first time at Coin Rush, isn't it? Yeah. It's massive. And all these flashing lights make it hard to figure out where to start. Flashing lights? These lights may be dazzling, but they don't hold a candle to you! Aww. Oh, wow! Thank you for saying that! Dang. What a line. <laughs> it's easy to get lost in here, so why don't we explore the second floor together? We can talk to some of the other Nikkeis. And maybe dig up some juicy details about the other teams. <laughs> oh, she's playing the game. Let's go, Soda. I see you. That's a good idea. Ooh, so I get to wander around and explore with you guys? Yippee! Yes, Alice, we're on the same team. I'm so happy. We can also keep an eye out for the black and white bunnies at the same time. Can we really? Ah, oh, this is so exciting! <laughs> Okay, okay. Alice is actually kind of charming. I usually don't really pay too much mind to her. Let's head upstairs. We decided to explore co the Coin Rush's second floor, where the Game Zone and Drink Zone are located. Although we have a fair bit of time, we may not have quite enough to explore both areas properly. Let's check out the Game Zone since it's closer. Inside, there are rows of gaming consoles neatly arranged. In the midst of it, a large table stands, its expanse filled with an array of gaming paraphernalia. Wow! This must be where everyone comes for their gaming fix. I'm not too sure, but it definitely looks interesting. Next time, I should come here with Queen! That might not be the best idea, considering her situation with electronics. Oh yeah, that's true. Huh? Does she not know? I think I see someone gaming. Oh. She must be a participant as well, right? Off in the corner, I see a familiar figure. Who is it, Exia? Having a passionate gaming session. Mm -hmm. Oh, hey, hello. Oh, and she's wearing her cool outfit. I like this outfit. I'd recognize that voice anywhere. Hey there, newbie. Watson? Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, I forgot they're in the same squad. Gah! You startled me. Novel, who has been crouching on the ground out of sight, suddenly leaps up and stares at me. Well, well. Look who decided to pop up out of nowhere. This is a most interesting turn of events. This calls for my powers of deduction. Okay. The fact that Watson is here means he must be participating in the upcoming event. Oh. Okay, Sherlock. But can't be possible, since he's neither a part of Tetra nor a Nike. Therefore, the only conclusion is that Watson has trespassed into this area. I like how she says she's accusing me of a crime with that big old smile on her face and twinkles in her eyes. What do you think of my deduction, Exia? It is precisely as I expected. Now's not the time for games, but for gathering intel on the other teams. I'm afraid you're off base. You can have a team member who is neither affiliated with Tetra nor a Nikkei. She would read everything. Huh? Is that so? Very well then. Considering these new clues, I can only deduce that these three before me are on the same team. What say you, Exia? Well... I think you're pointing out the obvious at this point. You can at least try to guess who the team leader is. All right, then. Novel leans her facing close to Alice and Soda. Hmm. Wow. <laughs> uh, I've got it. Soda has a puzzled expression on her face, while Alice appears more at ease. Therefore, I conclude that Alice is the team leader. Man, maybe you shouldn't pride yourself as being a detective. What say you? Um, oh dear, did I guess incorrectly? Yeah. Anyways, what are you two doing here? As Change you the subject. See, we are playing.
playing a game. We were about to move around to gather information on the other teams. Hold up. Isn't it supposed to be one team leader and two additional members? Where's your third team member? You see, Exia? They're trying to gather intel on us. She is on the first floor. All the heat coming from the machines made her feel uncomfortable. Oh. <laughs> How can you reveal such precious information to them? <laughs> hey, y'all are in my outpost. I know everything about you guys. <laughs> What's the point of being so secretive about it? They'll see who she is when the match starts anyway. Oh, right. Then they must have come here to obtain other information from us. Why are you all participating in the competition? All sorts of incidents are bound to happen at this kind of event. So, being a detective, I've come here to conduct a preliminary investigation of the crime scene to be. Crime scene to be? I'm here because I think games are fun. Yeah, that's an Exia answer gotcha. right there. Well, we came here to win! Ooh, <laughs> amazing! Alice. I hope it works out for you! Yeah, thank you, Novel. <laughs> Thanks! Wait, does that mean you two don't care about winning? Novel and I aren't particularly bothered about it, but our team leader on the first floor probably cares a great deal. She practically begged us to join her. If they're both team members, then their team leader must be from another squad. Who could it be? I wonder. Huh? Can we go over there? Alice points at the drink zone on the opposite side. We're starting to run low on time, so moving on might be a good idea. Alright, let's go. Are you going to explore other areas? If you happen to see anything suspicious, be sure to let me know. We will. Will do. Probably not. <laughs> good luck to you, Alexia. And good luck to you too with your investigation novel. Ah, so supportive. After leaving the game zone, we arrive at the drink zone. Inside, there are various drinks and an array of opulent glasses. Numerous chairs have been set up so that you can sit down and comfortably enjoy your drink. Wow. Nice. They even have welcome drinks here. According to this note, each participant can enjoy a glass. And the drink is supposed to be sweet and sour. Sounds delicious! Let's try it! All of us take a glass and have a sip. Mm, it's lovely! Oh no! Alice! <laughs> so sour! I'm salivating! <laughs> oh girl. It seems a bit too sour for your taste, Alice. You can also order whatever drink you'd like from the bar over there. I'm sure there's something there Alice would be a fan of. As we approach the bar, I notice familiar silhouettes from afar. Why is it rhyme? <laughs> As we get closer, I realize who it is I'm looking at. Cafe Sweetie? Hmm. Oh boy. Only one person would address us with such a sweet voice. Are you flirting with me? What? Don't be ridiculous. What? I never thought I'd see you here! There's a lot of Nikkeis here that I'm not used to hearing voice. It's kind of crazy. Hey, tired. So you all are participating as well? Of course. This could be an excellent opportunity to give Black Typhoon a new makeover. What are you talking about? We already agreed that we'd make a sparring arena inside the cafe. Oh boy. No, oh, king sized bed. Oh gosh, here we go again. It sounds like you didn't agree on anything. Me, leader. You may be the squad leader, but I'm the team leader for this event. Huh? I thought I was the team leader. <sighs> Bummer. Girls, girls, girls. But keep arguing. It, uh. It will work to our advantage. I'm leader. I can't with you two! Fight! Fight! <laughs> um, excuse me. What? What do you want? Hey, 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 watch your tone. You don't talk to Soda like um, that. Can you tell me what you're drinking? It looks delicious. <laughs> yeah, they don't look sour at all. They smell super sweet. Very nice. You two have a good eye for quality. I'm drinking sugar coffee with just the right amount of sugar added. 
<laughs> just the right, meaning half. What are you talking about? They're clearly asking about the milk coffee that I'm drinking. The milk is what gives it that creamy smoothness. Cream coffee, lots of cream. Sweet, smooth, the best. Uh, I, I think I'll try the cream coffee. Good choice. I'm a big fan of dairy, so I'll go for a milk coffee. Very smart. Here you are. Ah, uh, rip sugar. Hmm. Uh oh okay I'm the I'm going to be the nice one the diplomatic one. Uh I think I'll try the sugar coffee. I knew I could count on your impeccable taste. <laughs> I like sugar. Partner. Mm. Sip. <laughs> As I thought it's sickeningly sweet. By the way, partner, are you teamed up with these two? Yes, that's right. Is that so? Is that a problem? The thrill of competition where men and women go head to head in close quarters. Where are you, where are you, where are you going with this, sugar? <laughs> How exciting. I can't tell if she's being sarcastic, but she's also blushing. Well, we have no intention of pulling any punches. So this competition will be done fair and square. The three of you will have to bring your A game. Huh? Okay. You're here to win after all. Very nice. I like your determination. Oh yeah, that's right. Milk is the uh, the competitive one. You must be the team leader. Um, actually, I'm the team leader. Oh really? Then you have to be more confident. You can't be shriveling in the corner like that. Er, okay. Although Cafe Sweetie may first appear quite chaotic. They are highly proficient at problem solving and thinking on their feet. Also, Soda appears more deflated than usual, so we have to stay on our toes. How about we head back to the first floor? Oh, sure, I suppose. Sounds good! Are you all heading back down? Yeah, we just said that. Th yeah, thanks for the coffee. If I drink from the same cup that you took a sip from, would that be considered as indirect kissing? Sh sugar <laughs> I didn't I didn't realize you had the side on you would you shut your yap anyway see you all later and yes to answer your question it would be indirect kissing sugar <sighs> they're gonna be down to two team members because Freema's gonna be asleep as we wrap up our initial exploration of coin rush we head back to the main hall on the first floor. I want to see what happens if you click on the first choice. So I'm going to click on this one again. Might be a good idea to go to one of the floors and chat with them. All right. So we reloaded this so that we can see this, the second option. So I chose the second floor first time. Now I'm going to check the first floor. It's easy to get lost in here. So why don't we explore the first floor together? We can talk to some of the other Nikkeis. And maybe dig up some juicy details about the other teams. That's a good idea. I like the sound of sticking together too. Let's wander around together. Twinkling Bunny! Gravity! Sure thing. I slowly survey my surroundings. In front of us is a massive stage that Blanc Noir normally perform on. Along with the equally gargantuan disco ball. I miss the bustling crowd. I can't help but notice the many familiar faces scattered throughout. While we may have a fair amount of time, it won't be enough to speak to everyone. Talentum seems to be the closest squad to us, so let's start with them. So the strategy this time is... Oh, what? Damn. I mean, I have her skin, but it's this is top tier. I remember when they released this, she was the first gotcha skin. I don't even use rupee anymore but man this is top tier just like crown's gotcha skin is top tier i mean it better be considering it's gotcha huh wait a second rupee would you please stop interrupting me no it's not that isn't that sweetie coming over to us sweetie hi rupee whoa it's a golden bunny huh 
Hey guys. Whoa! I'm surprised to see you here. I forgot she has a, a Western accent. The fact that you're here must mean. Oh, hi, Dala. You're participating with a team. Wait, how does that work? You're not even with Tetra, and certainly not a Nike. There was some fine print in the notification. Dala would read that. One team member can be anyone you want. Really? Darn. I hate the idea of going up against you, honey. Are you teaming up with Soda and Alice? Yes, Soda is our team leader. So you're participating under the maid for your banner. I heard that they were going through some tough times. Looks like you're aiming for a big payoff. Hey, hey, Dala. What the hell? How intrusive. <laughs> I guess no information gets past her. She probably would have that kind of shady information, I suppose. Nothing gets past this girl. Uh, you know about that? Yeah, how, how do you know about this? Of course. Information is the most valuable thing you can possess in this business. Are you all after the Tetra chip as well? Naturally. Once we win this competition, I'm going to ask Mustang for a significant payout. You can never have enough money, and I'm sorely lacking in it. Oh boy. These guys are going to be very competitive. Plus, if there's anyone on this planet who can supply me with fat stacks of cash, it's Mustang. Exactly. Although, if we do get first place, there's liable to be infighting amongst ourselves. Yeah, fight! Yeah, that's right. Yeah, you know. Argue some more, guys. You need to figure out who gets the money. I see that you're dressed in a buddy theme today, Ruby. That's right. I always wear this outfit whenever I do a live stream at Coin Rush. Lupin simply can't get enough of it. I can hardly blame them. It looks great. Why, thank you. Are you planning to live stream here? She just said. Of course. I better not see myself show up in anything. I retain all rights to my likeness. Damn, Yan. Likewise. Don't be ridiculous. I wasn't planning on filming either of you from the start. Oh, oh, infighting, infighting. <laughs> Use that to our advantage. True to form, Talentum is composed of big and bold personalities, but when the situation calls for it, they're capable of acting like a remarkably well-oiled machine. By the way, client. Yes? You came to see us as soon as you had a free moment. Are you scoping us out? Nothing gets past this girl. What? Uh, good dollar, but no, no, it's nothing like that. Wow, oh, so we seem like pushovers then, is that it? <laughs> oh, girl, it's on. We're gonna win and you guys are gonna lose. We're gonna point and laugh. No, 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 no. Hmm. I don't think Soda or Alice have been to Coin Rush. I presume what he's doing is showing them around the place. And getting better sense of who's participating while they do so. Maybe it wasn't a good idea to come to the first floor. Isn't that right? Yen sure is sharp. We need to be on our toes. Well, whatever the reason may be, I'm glad you came to see me, sweetie. Aww, I can count on Rupee being sweet to me. However... Ah, uh, never mind. Even if it is you, I won't go easy on you. Oh, gosh. Look at this skin! It's distracting. <laughs> We're going to give it our all regardless. That's it, I'm wearing a bunny suit. I'm gonna distract them back. I'm looking forward to how this pans out. Me too. Yeah, yeah you know what? We won't go easy on you either. A conversation with Townsend draws so close. Oh, there are way more rabbits here than I thought there would be. I'm on cloud nine right now. Where are we going next? Are there going to be more rabbits there as well? Only one way to find out. Let's go. Okay. Okay. With a swift glance, I spot Prima Donna off in the distance. Hey. This is my, this is my first time seeing Arya in anything. I don't think they use her for anything. <laughs> I don't even have her as a unit either. Oh, hey, volume. I'm the leader. 
Didn't we all agree to that? That may be true. That's what she sounds like? But that doesn't mean you can push us around. Pushing you around? Don't you think that's a bit harsh? <sighs> I like, oh, Noise is one of my favorites, and I like how she's like, ah, sick of this f***ing team. I'm already getting tired of this. What are you all up to? Huh? Producer? What are you doing here? Are you here to cheer us on? I'm so touched. No, that can't be it. Oh? Only participants can enter this area. So Maestro must have joined one of the teams. Oh, really? She's upset. Is that even possible? Who's the team leader? Oh! That would be me! <laughs> really? Doesn't seem like a team we should be worried about. Dog! Oh! You know what volume? Oh my gosh. I knew it. I knew she was gonna be a bully. And wipe that smug off your smug smug smile off your face. Uh, no, Soda, don't listen to her. She doesn't know what she's talking about. She thinks she's a rapper. How can you? Aw, oh, damn it! So we have to compete against producer? Seems like it. Why are you all participating in this competition? For the sake of our future performances. Of course, we're more than capable of staging an amazing performance on our own. But if we have Mustang's backing, we could take things to a whole other level. Ah, shit. Exactly. They have proper motivation. With Mustang's golden chip, we can put on a performance that will be the talk of the town. Ah, she sounds like a... like a super proper lady. She just sounds very uppity. Plus, the competition itself is a blast. If we win, we're gonna make it so the next competition centers around hip-hop. That way, no one else would stand a chance against us. <sighs> <laughs> Noise is like, what the f***? I didn't, I didn't agree with that. <sighs> Neither does Arya. There seems to be some internal strife within Prima Donna. There's internal strife in all these teams. We got this. However, with each one demonstrating such formidable strength individually, it's clear they cannot be under underestimated. Anyway, I understand you must have good reasons for participating, but I have no intentions of going easy on you. Uh, after all I've done for you, Noise, this is how you talk to me, your number one fan? I look forward to an exhilarating match. We don't expect you to go soft on us either. Oh, believe me, I ain't soft. Good luck. Same to you. Our conversation with Prima Donna draws to a close. Phew. I didn't realize any... I didn't really do anything, but I feel like my energy has been depleted. Uh -huh. Oh, now her feelings are hurt. Soda also seems a bit morose. Soda, now you alright? Huh? Oh, yeah. Of course. Coin Rush sure seems like a fun and exciting place. And so big. That's what she said. Thanks for accompanying me, you guys. I had fun too! I'm still a bit bummed that I didn't get to see the black and white bunnies. I thought for sure we'd run into one of them. <sighs> Hold on. I think I see bunny ears in front of the stage over there. Do you think it might be them? Huh? Where? Oh my gosh, you're right! It's them! Alice breaks into a run. I follow Alice, thinking that Blanc Noir must be must have arrived. Huh? Much to my surprise, it is Folk Wang and Mary who are dressed up as bunnies. Hell yeah! Holy shit! I didn't even notice this part. Look, at, she's practically sweating her ass off in these stockings. I think her animation is that she pours it on herself. But damn, that's hot. Also married though. She is not slacking. Look at this outfit. I want to check out the Mary skin. All right, so. Now this is a bunny suit. Zoom in a little bit, you know? Oh look, she also has that weird cable thing that Soda and Alice have. Do you think younger patients will get a kick out of this bunny outfit? <laughs> I 
I'm only joking. Mary! You're trying to expose yourself to the children? Damn! <laughs>